you know, half half the roster is flipped over, and it's, it's a much different looking team than last year. How has that been blending guys in and just you know, getting the culture? How you guys like it? The chemistry? Uh, it's been really, really good. Uh, I feel like last year with COVID, uh, it was hard to, you know, get the camaraderie that we wanted throughout the season. Um, but this year, with the restrictions kind of loosening up a little bit, uh, the camaraderie com camaraderie has been there since day one. Um, I definitely say this is the closest team um, that I've been on since being here, and that's not a knock on any of the other teams. But uh, this unit is definitely close. We uh, we've done a lot of activities uh, outside of basketball, and we really just like each other. Uh, we have a, a genuine care and love for each other outside of the game. Um, so I'd say this team is a, it's a close knit group, and we definitely like each other. Pro day earlier this week. Just how did that experience go? How did you feel like you were able to perform? It was awesome. Um, I feel like we. Uh, executed the plan for, to perfection. I feel like everybody came out there, played hard, um, and did what they were supposed to do. They showed the scouts uh, what they were capable capable of, and I feel like as a unit, uh, we showed what we were capable of. Um, we played hard. We had each other's backs, and so I think uh, that experience altogether was just amazing. I appreciate uh, the coaches, MC, for everybody, um, Coach GP, for setting it up, um, just letting us get out in front of those scouts. Um, there was a good bit of them, and it was just a lot of fun, a, a great, great event for us as a team try to ignore them, like just do what you do in a normal day of practice? Is it even possible to ignore them in that situation? I mean, yeah, you, I mean, we have scouts come in from time to time, but definitely not that many at once. Uh, but yeah, you just, you go about your day, you do what you, you do what you do, and you just focus on your work on the court. And I just say that we had good focus on, we focused on picking each other up and having good energy and bringing energy to the court and not focusing on the outside and the people who were there. Josiah, how different was the off season in terms of what you guys were able to do on court with, with coaches compared to what it was like a year ago? It was a lot different. Um, I feel like that uh, was a big step we took forward this year, this year and this summer, uh, just being able to, to get out there, play pickup, um, just get in the gym whenever we wanted because um, the summer before you had set times, you could only be there for a certain amount of time. But guys this year, they were hungry. They were in the gym 24-7. And so I felt like that um, – allowed us to come closer on the court and learn each other's games a lot quicker. Uh, I think it'll help us out in the, in the long run. With those eight newcomers, just the defensive side, how much does everyone get comfortable with what y'all do defensively and then understanding just how important each possession is? I think they picked it up really quickly. Uh, we still have a long way to go. Um, and I'll say we have a long way to go as a team, not just the eight newcomers, but they definitely um, hit the ground running. They picked up a lot of the new stuff quickly and easily, especially on the defensive end. Um, but they're still learning, you know, freshmen, they go through their lumps and bruises and things like that. They're still learning their, uh, the system, uh, but we all are. We all have to take every day uh, as a day to get better. Um, but they've definitely um, learned it a lot, a lot quicker than I did. I'll say that. So, Frank, what's the biggest difference of your game this year? I'd say my leadership, um, just being, uh, holding myself to the highest standard possible and holding myself accountable, accountable each and every day um, and holding others accountable. Um, just being able to be somebody that coach can count on um, and that coach doesn't have to do each and every, or none of the coaches have to do each and everything, that we are a team-led unit um, with coaches just in the background. And I think my leadership, uh, as well as others, has stepped up. What about on the court, where you feel like you've grown the most? Uh, just in my, my shooting, uh, my shot-making ability, uh, and then just my mindset of being in attack mode all the time, um, just not playing back on my heels all the time, just being aggressive. Uh, I'd say my mindset and then my, my outside shot. How much did the wrist affect your shooting last year and kind of when did you feel healthy again after surgery? Uh, yeah, it affected a lot. I got hurt during the Kansas game. Um, and so I would say that I wasn't really healthy until I got the surgery. Um, and it took, it was about a three and a half month recovery. Um, but I, I took it as a, a blessing in disguise to, to work on other aspects of my game to get my body right. Um, and so I'm, I'm grateful that uh, I was able to, to do a lot of things because it was just a wrist injury. Um, thankfully, it wasn't anything major. Um, but yeah, I'd say that it definitely affected my game a lot, uh, my, my spear. But I will give credit to the guys here. They, they knew what I was going through. Um, and they never let me get down on myself. They told me to, to keep shooting. They never let me have a, have a bad day. So I credit the coaches and, and my teammates here uh, for keeping me in good spirits. Just like you talked about your leadership and you know what it's like being a primary ball handler playing for this guy. What did you kind of try to teach Kennedy about uh, how, to, how to deal with some of the tough practices? Yeah, coaches, he's going to expect the most out of you. Um, and, and Kennedy knew that coming in. And he's 
he's done as well as the job I've seen anybody do. Um, just knowing that coach's expectations are only uh, out of love for you. Coach is going to get on, on you because he loves you. And if he didn't, uh, then you'd have a problem to worry about. But Kennedy has, has really assumed the role of, of a really good point guard. Um, he's picked everything up quickly. Um, but he knows that there's going to be good days and bad days. I told him that. And just being uh, somebody who can minimize the bad days or bad plays um, and not get too down on himself, I uh, know that there's another, another possession, another plays um, for a full 40-minute game. And we have better days ahead of us. What stands out the most about Kennedy Camp? His speed. He's lightning quick. Um, he gets to wherever he wants to go. He doesn't really let the defense affect him. Um, and then just his, his playmaking ability, he's able to see the court very well. Um, yeah, his speed and his playmaking, playmaking ability. You think this group can find some more consistency than you guys found last year? Definitely. I, I definitely think so. And I think that uh, it all starts with our leadership, not with the coaches, but with me um, being consistent on a daily basis and requiring it of my other teammates, just holding myself to the highest standard and to the, this team to the highest standard. So I think that we've definitely had a lot more building blocks of building days of good days in a row. And that's how you become great, just doing the little things right. Um, and I think that this team has done that pretty well up, to, up until this point. Josiah, I know it's early in camp, but who do you feel has taken that next step so far in this camp? Definitely Santi. Um, he's gotten his body in shape. Um, his, his game is the best, as I, best that I've ever seen it uh, offensively and defensively. I think that uh, he's definitely in for a big season this year. How have you seen him grow defensively? Just the effort he plays with. He plays hard 24-7. And um, I think that uh, he leads his teams when we do four on four, five on five. Just the leadership he shows on the defensive end, the pride he takes in defense um, has really improved. Everybody good?